And now to politics, Lagos State gov Governorship candidate for the Labour Party in the 2023 gubernatorial election in Lagos State, Badebo Roads Vivor, has reiterated his commitment to infrastructural development in the state. It made the commitment at a rally organized by the party along Ikotun Ijegun Road in the state. The Labour Party governorship candidate laid emphasis on infrastructural neglect of successive governments in the area, which according to him has led to flooding during the raining season. He also promised the people that his government will be people-oriented and that many of the unions over the years will be attended to. In our campaign, we are focused on building communities. We are not we are not interested, we are not campaigning. This is a movement, and we are doing things to empower that movement, to have to make people feel a sense of belonging that this is their project. It's not just for the politicians. We are not leaving politics with politicians alone. We are bringing everybody so that they can get involved. That's what is different with our campaign. In terms of our government, it's going to be a transparent and accountable one. It's going to be one that is that the social contract between the people and the government is sacrosanct because Lagos State has, they keep taking pride in the amount of money that they generate. If you are generating money from people, there must be a social contract. We must be servant leaders. We must be accountable. We must be able to give line by line items of the budget and how we spend things. And we should take pride in delivering projects at the best possible price in fastest possible time with the best possible materials for the most people. We are having flyover bridges and ramps that are done at five times the price. We have roads that are done four times the price as the World Bank benchmark for what roads should be done in Nigeria. And that's why our infrastructure deficit is so huge. But if we have people that are working based on accountability, we'll have a situation where we have times four, five, the infrastructure that we ought to have.